New for us here tonight at 10 o'clock, a city of Berwyn employee is now under investigation after police say she admitted to yelling racial slurs at a black man while on the job and driving a city vehicle. Now that man is calling for justice. CBS 2's Marissa Perlman live in Berwyn with a story you'll see only on two. Marissa. Well, Joe, this story is all spelled out in a police report that we obtained. It all happened not far from here, from City Hall, just a few blocks. That city employee is also a member of the Berwyn South School District. And that man you mentioned says he's speaking with us because he's worried this could happen to somebody else. It's just not about me. It's about everybody else that she looks at like that. Philip Robin was hired in May to remove a tree from this property in Berwyn. And it was right back here in the alley. According to Berwyn police, a city of Berwyn car pulls up. The driver, later identified as Sarah Lopez, starts yelling at Philip to move his work truck from the alley. She kept screaming at me. Phil showed us his permit from the city that allowed him to work and park there. He says after he turned his back to continue working, the confrontation got worse. You cannot turn your back on me. You I said, excuse me? After Phil refused to move his truck, police say it was Sarah Lopez who first called them to the scene. In a police report obtained by CBS2, the responding officer writes, I asked Sarah if there was any name calling involved, and Sarah related to me, yes, I called him an N-word, and then made the statement, I am so sick and tired of these people. A city official with that authority should not be able to treat people like this. Sarah Lopez works as a blight inspector with the buildings department and was on patrol during the incident. She is still on the job. She's also listed as an active member of the school board. I'm Marissa Perlman with CBS Chicago. We went to City Hall to try to find out what, if anything, is being done. An admin with the city tells us the case is under an internal investigation through the mayor's office and they couldn't comment further. Phil and his lawyer had a sit down with the mayor who apologized. He told us he took care of the situation. He gave her a verbal reprimand and he's apologizing to me and that was that. Is that enough? No, not even close. Phil now hoping the city employee and school board member who he says should be held to a higher standard will be held accountable. It's not right. I just want to be treated fair and now, we did speak with Sarah Lopez by phone this afternoon. She could not comment or confirm anything about the police report, but did tell us she is a member of the city and the school board. And we want to be clear tonight. Sarah Lopez is not facing any criminal charges. Now, again, it's also not clear if the school board is aware of this police report or this complaint. We will be following up. We are live tonight in Berwyn. Marissa Perlman, CBS 2 News. Thank you, Marissa.